this with your parents or not by, by your, your, yourself? That's right. Do it with your parents and not by yourself. Hey, Corey. Hi, Mommy. You ready? Yeah. Okay, let's tell them who we are. Hey, guys, it's CJ and Cole. And it's always a treat with CJ and Corey. Oh, no. Hey guys, it's CJ and Corey. And we are back with another Snack Break. Snack Break. Today is a super simple, super easy, super sweet snack that you guys can make with whatever fruit you have at home. We are talking about fruit salsa, baby. Yeah. yeah, you can use whatever fruit you like. We always like to add apple for a little crunch and strawberry. Mine. But other than that, Mine. whatever you have goes. What's up, babe? Miller of sweet and salt. Sweet and salt? Yeah. And that's the twist today. We're gonna have our sweet salsa with a little salty crunch. This is the banana plantain crisp. Mm -mm. Sweet and salty go so well together. Ask your parents, I bet they love it. Chocolate, peanuts, mm -hmm. We like to put raisinets in our popcorn. We love the sweet and salty mix. We to try those. So we are gonna get right into it. Okay guys, let's go. You ready? Yeah. 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 All right guys, we have some fresh strawberries, some pineapple chunks, a peach, green apple, we are about to dice this fruit up and get into some fresh fruit salsa. You make the big chunks and then I'll put the smaller chunks in the bowl. We're chopping up some apples. She's cutting them into chunks and then I'm dicing them up. Almost slap in my face. <laughs> Be careful. Don't put your knife towards your face. You're doing great getting those chunks for me. There you go. Oh, thank you. You guys can dice your veggie or fruits. <laughs> I'm used to saying veggies when you're doing salsa, huh? Dice your fruits <laughs> as small as you like or as big as you like. Chunky fruit salsa. Oh, this is a small one. Now some recipes for fruit salsa call for like um, adding like a, a jam or a marmalade or something to like put it together, but we like to just have it naturally sweet from the fruit and it'll stick together anyway. Juices, mix it up, it's good to go. Cutting it up, baby. Cutting it up, baby. Look, mix um, some uh, small ones and some big ones. You're doing great. This is gonna be so yummy, and with that salty, crispy chip. Mm -hmm. Want to do this with your parents or not by, by your, your, yourself? That's right. Do it with your parents and not by yourself. I don't know what it is. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> You're not, so funny. Be uh, oh, oh. I caught it on my apron. Oh wow, yes. look at that. Right, Our right, salsa right. is coming together. Yeah. Get a little bit closer. Get a little closer. Yeah. So we can't like um, reach. Oh, you couldn't reach? No. Oh my gosh. What other kind of fruits would you add in your salsa that we don't have here? Um, some droppers maybe. Yeah, I would add that, but you know what else I would add? I think I would add, ooh, kiwi. If I had kiwi, ooh, mango. Yeah. I would definitely add mango. We like mango too. I know you love mango. Maybe clementines? Yeah. That'd be cool. I can't cut this thing. <laughs> oh, it's ripping in the way. So today's recipe is just a bunch of dicing and getting our fruit into our bowl and mixed up. Yeah, and you will want to do it. Do it with um, us, mm -hmm. girl. You, you love my lip gloss. Mm. Huh? 
Okay, girl, I thought you were gonna tell them something about uh, the, the, the snack today. Okay, guys, this is what I have in here. Ooh, it looks good so far. We're gonna keep on dicing. Adding all those fruits in. So far, we're getting our peaches and our apples in. We're gonna add our pineapple and our strawberry. Ooh, we're gonna put it on a cute little platter and tear it up. Right? All oh my accessories. My accessories. <laughs> this is like Barbie accessories. This is like Barbie accessories. What? Oh we my said gosh. it. You are so funny. Excuse me, I'm reaching over you. Yeah. Grabbing another peach. You could use peach or nectarines. I mean, honestly, truly, you can use whatever fruit you have and what you like. And guys, don't hurt, hurt yourself with that knife. Yeah, use a kid's safe life knife. Mommy is using her knife. This is sharper. And Corey is using a kid-friendly knife. That's from Handstand Kitchen. We love Handstand Kitchen. Woman-owned company. They have super awesome products for your kids. We like their baking sets. This knife actually came with her yeah. unicorn cutting board. And we're going to use that unicorn cutting board instead of our snack today. We have tons of kids safe and kid friendly cooking items um, listed it's, on it, our. Um, it's come in a box. Yeah, it comes in a box. We have them listed on our Amazon storefront, so you guys be able to be um, be sure to check that out if you need to grab some for home mommies and daddies to cook with your kids. So you get all the experiences, uh, all the experience of cooking oh. with something safe for them. We haven't had any access oh. <laughs> <laughs> with our kid friendly cookware. Anything that we have listed, we have absolutely used ourselves. Oh, looking good. Looking good. Still cooking, still chopping. Corey's taking a snack break during the snack break. But it's looking so pretty. It's coming together. We love all the colors and the flavors. The strawberries are so sweet. I don't even think this is like strawberry season now in fall, but these are good. All right, let's get back to it. We're almost ready to eat it. Well, me. She's already eating. We gotta add some pineapples. That's the only fruit we haven't added in yet. It's just one in here. One strawberry left? Because you ate half of our strawberries. Don't be like Corey, guys. Save some of the fruit for the actual salsa. We are taking a break from chopping because Corey wants to try the cookie brittle. We also have banana uh, dark chocolate double chunk cookie brittle here. <clears throat> We're gonna use that for a scooper dipper for our salsa also. Oh, a member of Hattie? Yeah, we love them. That's where we have them again. <laughs> Look at that. That looks good. Chocolate baby. <laughs> Chocolate baby. All right, well, I'll add in the pineapple while Corey is still snacking.
Okay guys, we hope you enjoyed this snack break. This is good. Corey has been eating the entire time, right? You guys let us know if you tried this at home and what fruit you're like trying. It now. So bright. <laughs> they probably have fruit and chocolate all in it. Guys, this with the plantain crisp, the banana plantain crisp, oh my God. Oh my God. It was so good, guys. Okay. You guys have got to make this at home. Let me um do it again. so good you guys let us know we know you can't leave comments here because we are a kid friendly channel but we are always hanging out over on our instagram right mm -hmm. Corey likes to make reels watch reels let us know okay we'd like to connect with <laughs> if i could not spit everything out we love to connect with you guys over on our instagram so make sure you come over there and hang out with us right Corey? Mm -hmm. all right guys we'll see you next time for another Snack break with our mouth full of snacks. Let snack us know break. if you try this out. Let us know if you have some recipes you want to see. Subscribe to our channel. channel. This has been another episode of the Snack Break with CJ and Corey. We'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Bye.